Un, un momentito, voy a dar mi teléfono. <risa> ¿En? A sube el BCT. in the morning and welcome back to the channel welcome to the mountains of Guatemala look at this morning view incredible right there's some morning fog right over in the Bach and some of the other mountains it's amazing so it was a very <laughs> Very cold night, um, but now I'm gonna see what is for breakfast. <laughs> Ooh, look at all these tamales. Amazing. Buenos dias, chicos. Buenos dias. <laughs> Vamos a comer. Si? ¿Sí? Si. Sí. ¿Tienes hambre? <laughs> Tomo esta tortilla o esta. Ah, gracias. Gracias. Ah, ok, gracias. Adiós amigo. Listo. Adiós. Hasta luego. Chao. All right. So, off we go. Um, again, I don't really know where I'm going. I've got, I've received new instructions. <laughs> Oh, I'm loving this way of traveling. So first I got the instructions to meet these people. This uh, Ishil family. And now they have given me the next instructions to meet the next Ishil family. And basically my instructions are go past this community, keep on going. And then at some point I will encounter a field with big rocks. And just after the field with big rocks, there will be somebody else waiting for me. Uh, her name is Feliciana. And then that's all I know. So, yeah, let's find out. It's an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous day here in the mountains. But man, the, the, the night was cold. Oh, I was freezing. <laughs> there is no uh, insulation, no heating in these houses. So it gets it gets really cold. It's an awesome area and I see there's a small community up that ridge and there's a little road going all the way it's a very very steep ridge over there oh let me actually climb this little steep hill Look at this view. So I stayed the night in that community just on the other side of the hill. 
I can see still in the distance there is uh, Nabag. <laughs> this is spectacular. What an area. Ah, okay. Here, yeah, they told me you'll find one cruce, which is a crossroad, I think. And I think that road will go to that kind of road that, that hugs the ridge of the mountain. But they told me stay left. Because I have to end up probably, no wait, yeah, I think over there, you see a small village down there, and then afterwards I continue again to Nebach, so I'm going to do like a little circle over here. And you can see it, I think, from here pretty well. So I think I'm gonna go to that community on that ridge and in the last video I was riding on that side of the mountains. Just the cloud formations are spectacular, right? I'm just really glad that it's dry now and it doesn't look like it's gonna rain more. So that's good news because I don't know how steep the other uh, mountain sides are. <laughs> or how muddy so when it's dry it's it's not a problem I haven't seen a field with rocks yet there's some rocks maybe this is what he was talking about the uh, kind of big open field with rocks <laughs> I don't know. Uh, or maybe he was talking about this. There's a big uh, rock face here. Ah, now this must be the area with the rocks, surely. So Feliciana should be living somewhere after here. in this area. Wow, this is stunning. No houses though. Hola, una consulta. ¿Conoces a una mujer se llama Feliciana? Feliciana, ¿dónde más o menos? Algo en esta área. Me dijeron hay un área con muchas rocas. Entonces pienso es así. Y un poco después una casa con Feliciana. Yo, yo, yo no soy de aquí también. Ah, ok. No Creo que mira pues anda en una tienda preguntarle por ahí. Ah, hay un, ok. Por Feliciana, pero... No okay, gracias. Well, he's also not from here, but he says there's a small shop a little further. I can ask there. Oh, little 
chippies. Maybe this is the shop. Ah, here's the shop. Can anyone ask here? <laughs> Una consulta. Uh, ¿Usted conoce Feliciana? La señora Feliciana. No. 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 ¿Qué Feliciana? No sé, solo sé el nombre de Feliciana y vive algo en esta área, pero quizás no. Me dijeron después el área de las rocas, entonces pensé que está aquí, pero... ¿Qué voy eso? Es que ojalá trae algún apellido, sí. Sí, porque allá vive una doña Felicia, no solo. ¿Ah, sí? Eh. Ok, un poco más adelante. No, ya no, no. va a ir para allá, ya está aquí un camino. Ahí está, va recto. Aquí. Ah, para aquí. Aba, recto. Ah, allí, al lado, izquierda. Ah, izquierda. muchas gracias. Gracias. Okay. Down here, she says. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is. Oh, this is very slippery. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, I'm sliding all over the place. Muddy. Oh. Hola. Oh. ¿Conoces Doña Feliciana? Feliciana. Sí. Ok, gracias. Gracias. I just hope there's only one Lady Feliciana. Maybe there's more. I don't know. And then, let's ask somebody else. Hola. Hola. Buenas. Uh, Doña Feliciana. Feliciana López. Creo que sí. Tal vez hay en esta casa. ¿ven? Hay una señora. Unos... ¿Cuántos, ah. ¿Cuántos años tiene? No sé. Hay un mi suegra allá abajo, es Feliciana y hay otro pato, es como tiene unos 35 años, es, vive aquí, ¿ve? Ah, hay dos, ok. Solo conozco a um, Elena. Elena es de Universidad de Ischil y ella me da el contacto con Feliciana, pero tengo, tengo el número de ella. Pero no sé si hay señal aquí. Hay señal aquí, llámalo. Bueno. Hola, Feliciana. Sí, hola, buenos días. Buenos días. Um, yo estoy en... ¿Cómo se llama el, aquí? Vijolón 2. Soy en Vijolón 2. Ahora estoy con señora María con Glucho. María con Glucho. Ah, María con Glucho. Oh, un, un momentito, voy a dar mi teléfono. <risa> ¿El? ¿A su vez? ¿El VCT? Ya bajito, ya bajo. Siana, 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 pina, ¿eh? Su papá, ¿qué se hace? Ella vive allá en Vijolón 3, dice la otra altea, la otra altea atrás de esta joya, ven, te vas, ahí está la carretera. Ajá, sí, 
Ahí te vas directo allí y después hay una tienda, lo preguntas en la tienda. Ok, ok. Y después subes para arriba. Ok, muy bien. Muchas gracias, señora. Adiós. Okay, I have to ask in another shop. So the lady at the first shop, she gave me directions to another Feliciana. So there are two, <laughs> but it's, it's the other one. So, but these instructions are, I didn't really understand it. I have to go down to the road and then to a shop and then ask again. That's the plan. I'm now on the main road, I think. Let's see if I can find a shop. Hola. ¿Usted conoce a Doña Feliciana? ¿Es usted? No me acuerdo. <laughs> una vuelta. Sí, se va directo. Sí. Se va directo y directo. Uh -huh. Hay una vuelta así, ve, ya para yendo así. Y ahí está ella ahí, se va a esperar en el camino. Ok. Muchas gracias. All right. A little bit further then. She's waiting for me somewhere. So I've successfully managed to locate two Felicianas. <laughs> but hopefully now soon I'll find number three, which is actually the one that I was looking for. I think maybe this is her or not. Feliciana! Yay! <laughs> En moto, sí. Opa. Mucho gusto. ¿Cómo estás? Bien. Bien. Qué lindo lugar. Wow. Increíble. So I finally found the right Feliciana. There, there. Her family is now building a new, brand new house over here. So everything is a little bit under construction, but she invited me into the kitchen. Um, so we're going to prepare some more food. Esos son tamales. Hey, esta es salsa de tomate o? Sí. Ah, ya. Qué rico. Pollo. Pollo. Sí. Wow. Qué rico. Sí. <laughs> y este es van a cocinar adentro el agua acá. Ah, oh, sí. Ah, sí. ¿Y cuánto tiempo para cocinar en el agua? Media hora. Oh. Sí. Ah, ahora vamos a poner los tamales en el agua. ¿Qué no está adentro? Ah, entonces en esta manera el maíz se, sí. se va. Ah, ok, ok. Esta nos va a servir. Ya. Yeah. No y ese también usa para el fuego, ¿no? Ajá, para, para el fuego también. Igual. Sí. So we first put the ones where we already take the corn off and then the tamales, they go on top. I think so they, they float or something. I don't know. 
furniture. Yo puedo, puedo hacerlo. Sonríe a la cámara. Uh, es duro. Sí. Es muy duro. Para hacer ejercicio. Sí. So I've been grinding the corn, um, so now it turned into this, and we're going to use that to make a type of drink, and I keep on forgetting the name, but I think that's the drink that yesterday I got it to the other family as well. And this morning for breakfast, it is super nice. It's really delicious. Check out this tamale with chicken. Oh, oh wow, look es at this. Wow. Omelette with vegetables, then there is lots of tortillas, and these are the stuffed tamales with chicken with tomato sauce inside. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Mm, gracias. Con tortilla. Ah, sí. Ah, ya. <laughs> okay. Otra vez. <laughs> Chao. Adiós, chao, chao. <laughs> oh, this was fantastic food, fantastic food. The clouds are uh, rolling in again, so I hope it will stay dry. So my next assignment is pretty much finding my way back to Unebach and I'm going to try to find Elena again who I met in the previous video and who got me in contact with uh, these women I'm going to try to find her house again and tell her that everything went okay I learned something else interesting is that Everybody in the Ishio communities, they have Spanish names like Feliciana.
but then they also all have their Ishil names. So for example, Feliciana, her Ishil name was Sib. And her mother's Ishil name, I think it was Nil, I think they said. So that also means that, for example, the other two ladies that I uh, came across today, that were also called Feliciana in Spanish, they will also be called Sip in um, Ishil. So that will be the same name for all the Felicianas, if you know what I mean. Hi, horses. Okay, I have reached Nebach again. I just uh, passed a point where on the way up there with Elena and her husband we decided on which way to go. So now I return from the other side. So that means I'm now on the exact same road that we came on. So I should be able to <laughs> trace down my steps and find their house again. Just retrace my steps back to the restaurant and from there I could remember. Hola! Ya estoy llamando a tu madre. Elena está? No, no está Elena. Ah, okay, okay. No, solo quiero decir a tu mamá que todo bien y todo fue bien. All right, Elena is actually out somewhere in another community. So I just told her daughter then that uh, I'm fine and that I came back and it was amazing. And uh, I'm just gonna stay one more night here in the Bach. Hola. So I found a place to stay. Uh, right next door there is some construction, so there's some blaring music coming from over there. And uh, anyway, yeah, I'm back in the Bach. Uh, what an adventure. Um, I, I absolutely loved my stay with the Ishio people and it was really interesting. They were super nice and I had some amazing food. Um, so yeah, I just really enjoyed it. This is definitely not a touristy area at all and uh, that was just great and so, so beautiful. So I really enjoyed it and yeah, now I'm just getting ready to figure out where I'm going to go next actually. Um, so I'm going to do that now. That was it for today. I really hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe down below and then I'll see you in the next video.